All right, everyone, so um, how to make power off the grid, right? That means you're not connected to the grid in any way as far as electricity is concerned, and you need power to run your house, right? Um, there is, um, at least, there's many ways you can do this, but the most common way, as you guys can see here, is I've got a, uh, a whole bunch of solar panels here, right? So basically, we're using the free energy from the sun, we're capturing it with the solar panels that gets cre the once it gets captured it gets uh, transformed into electricity it gets tied into wires and that goes down into a battery bank that that stores that energy for a later period so that way like later on tonight whatever I'll have power uh, for my lights for my refrigerator for my cell phones, my TV, whatever you, you normally would normally use in a normal situation when you was to live on the grid, you can still absolutely do that with, um, um, you know, living off the grid as well. Um, the other way is I also have um, two wind turbines. So I have 1,500 watts of solar. Um, that's all solar panels. And then I have two wind turbines. And um, up until recently, I had six six-volt golf cart batteries, but I had one battery go bad on me, so I had to remove two, and um, I'm down to four batteries now, which is 440 amp hours of power I can use at any point I decide to use it. Um, after the after the DC power go, goes into here and charges up your batteries, it goes to your inverter. From your inverter, it transforms the the DC power to AC power that your your house normally uses that gets that jumps out of the the inverter it goes into a normal household breaker box and then from there you can divide up the circuits for wall plugs lighting refrigerator whatever it may be um it's just like any other house um and i've been doing this for four years guys so free energy every day i haven't had an electricity bill in over four years um it did take a little bit of money to set all this up but in four years, I mean, I can't even remember what an electric bill looks like anymore, guys. <laughs> so, yeah, that's what you're going to need, guys. You're going to need solar panels, wind turbines. Uh, if you live in an area where you have a river or a stream, you could probably hook up hydro, um, which is basically almost like the wind turbines itself, except it's not catching the wind. It's catching the, the movement of the water, right? Um, so, yeah, it's a really quick video, guys. Um, yep.